my mother. <laughs> yes, okay, extra for the devil right here. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so don't hate me for this question. Uh, Is there a small part careful. of you <laughs> Is there a small part of you that's actually grateful in some way that you were sued for that? Oh yeah, that's a, it, it, it comes, yeah. It, it really comes true in music and, yeah. and even, you know, coming to your shows and even though older work that I really enjoy, that all that stuff that you went through really comes through, not only on this album, but when you play live. Got it. Yeah, I'll repeat the question. Am I grateful in some way that I actually was sued for $30 million, which is a really bizarre thing to think about? But yes, I'm very grateful that I was sued for $30 million because it gave us the album of a lifetime, it gave us uh, the tour of a lifetime, it gave us this film, and it gave us, uh, I think, a greater sense of who we are. It gave us um, a, a lot more strength to the ability that, to know that we have or I guess the, the knowledge that uh, we have the strength to fight for what we believe in. I mean, it's absolutely nuts for a band, a little band like 30 Seconds of Mars to take on an entire industry like that is really kind of stupid. Uh, but I'm glad that we did it, and I'm glad that it did happen. It'll always be a really important part of our story. So yeah. Toronto Film Festival is gonna sue you for 50 million. Hey! <laughs> Yeah, there's one over there that's been waiting a while. Yes. Over there? Yeah. The hat. Yes. yes. Good, short and sweet. Why did we choose to call the film Artifact? It, it was a title that came, it really found us rather than us finding the title. And it was very early on. Uh, and I, I, I thought of the film as, I kept, I would say this early on to my editors, you know, if we were going to dig a hole on a mountaintop, uh, and, and everything in that, in that hole uh, was filled with, with uh, artifacts from this experience. What would they be? And that's what the film is. Um, so that's what, where it really came from, and, and it's stuck. And I also think it represents an antiquated um, uh, system uh, out there, um, parts of the record business, um, parts of the past. Next. Yes. Uh, I have two questions. Uh-oh, cheating. <laughs> Nice to see you. <laughs> I know half the people in this room. <laughs> Did you guys ever make your own record label? Would we ever make our own record label? That's the first question. Uh, you know, in, probably not. I'm not so interested in running a record label. I think that record labels... Um, uh, you think I'm going to say something funny, but I'm not. Uh, uh, I think that there are other people that are better suited for doing that job. I'm an artist. I don't want to run a record label. That's not what I'm interested in. Uh, Shannon and I like to make things and share those things with the world. Um, so that's what we're going to focus on. What's your other question? Yeah, I'll go to prom with you. She said, will you go to prom with me? Yes. You know what? I would go to prom with you uh, because I never went to a prom. <laughs> hey man, could you imagine this beard in the prom? <laughs> the teachers <laughs> being like, who is the creepy Uncle Jared over there? With the, prom? <laughs> the prom. This has got to be the most fun Q&A you've done yet, right? Go on. Uh, man, I'm going to the prom. I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Oh, thank you. <coughs> Great. Nice. Well, th thank you. I appreciate it. That's wonderful. He was saying, just to repeat, he said, uh, um, how do we, where do we get the miracle grow for our beards? <laughs> and then he said, uh, thank you for the echelon. It's amazing how many wonderful people have you met here. And everybody. <laughs> thank you. So, thank you. We do have to uh, turn this theater over for the midnight film, but here's the important part. I want you to listen here. We have a thing called... <laughs> They're throwing their clothes at us, not laughing at you. 
We have a thing That's called the time. People's Choice Award here at the Toronto Film Festival. Yes, this is very important. Okay, everybody, before you leave this room, hey, you, turn around. Where are you? No, no, no. Stay right. No, I need you. I need you. To vote. And I've been learning about elections recently, as you very well know. And it's important. Just exercise your vote. To vote, you take your ticket stub, there's a white box in the lobby, you stick your ticket stub in there, and then you voted. And, you know, I've seen where our counts are. If three quarters of the people in the room stuff that box with their ticket stub. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stand out there, you're not gonna leave until this. Yeah. So, what he's saying is there's a People's Choice Award. This should be the film. I mean, come on, we got a shot right here. Let's do this, right? That would be really fun. So make sure you stick that out there. Uh, stick, stick it in the box. It. Stick it in the box. Stick it and win, Echelon. Make it happen. Let's do this. Uh, there's two more. Yes, we can. <laughs> what did I say? Yes? We can. Yes? We can. Yes? We can. Let me hear. All right, pretty good. Whoa! Holy moly. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Very much. You know what to do with your ballots. The box. Don't forget, ticket in the bucket. Ticket in the bucket. Thank you guys so much. Goodbye. Thank you.